cooking oils you should probably avoid. So I've recently learned that a lot of popular oils may be hazardous in more than one way. First of which, a lot of popular oils are heavily processed. And during that process, they use a solvent called hexane, which is a cheap byproduct of making gasoline. Also, a lot of these oils are packed with omega-6 fatty acids, and those are good, but only in small doses. So the first type of oil you should probably avoid is canola oil. And there's a lot of different brands out there, but some common ones are Crisco and Wesson. Canola oil consumption has been linked to vitamin E deficiency, as well as shortened lifespan in animal studies. All right, next on the list is corn oil, and a popular brand is Mazzola. They actually advertise that it's good for reducing cholesterol, but what they don't mention is that it's actually processed with hexane as well, and it's packed with omega-6 fatty acids. Another one that you should probably avoid is vegetable oil, and most vegetable oil is made from soybeans, and those are mainly GMO soybeans. Vegetable oil is also packed with omega-6 fatty acids, and like I mentioned, a lot of people may be getting too much of that. So what are some oils that are good to use? Well, virgin coconut oil is always a good choice, and if you can get cold pressed, that's even better. Avocado oil is also a good one. Extra virgin olive oil is another good one. It has a lot of health benefits if you're getting a good source. And extra virgin sesame oil is another good one. 